start standing. You can start seated or standing, whatever works for you. Lift your heart. Relax your shoulders and your jaw. You can take three breaths from your belly and in and out through your nose. Fantastic. All right, give one second here. I want to add a little more light. Still playing with this. All right. So rolling march. Start with that rolling march. Again, lift your heart. Relax your shoulders. Rub your hands together. Relax. I'm just going to tap here. So tap your forearms. Elbow, other side, elbow, biceps, shoulders, or separate, or across, whatever works. Excellent. And your upper back, down to your hips, thighs, knees. Chins, calves, and then come back up to your knees, rub your knees, excellent, thighs, and hips, fantastic, that's good, excellent, shake that out, let your shoulders relax, you're going to turn your head over to one side, excellent, glance in behind with just your eyes, Excellent. Your eyes back in line with your head. Your head back to center. When your neck allows, the other side. Excellent. Glance in behind. Bring your eyes back in line with your head. And your head back to center again. Nice. Chin to chest. Keep your heart lifted. Excellent. Look towards your chin. Excellent. Bring your eyes back in line with your head. Head back up to center. Nice. One more. Gentle stretch on your neck. And look up. And bring your eyes back in line with your head. Fantastic. Roll with that. Uh, arms. Just going to roll your wrists. Start low. Slowly going to roll them up, shoulder height, excellent, change direction, nice, I'm just going to stop right here, just wiggle your fingers, nice, flex, excellent, and up, nice, Let's just extend your fingers towards the wall. Keep your torso straight. Excellent. Reach high and low. Spread your fingers. Nice. Gently back to center. On the other side, same thing. Excellent. And back to center again. Nice. And bring your arms down nice and easy. Shoulders. Forwards and backwards with your shoulders. So bring your shoulders round them in the front. And then touch your shoulder blades in the back. Nice and easy. And again, you work with, do what's good for you, right? Fantastic. I'm gonna do one more set here. And open. Bring your shoulders down to a rest. Add a little more onto that. So we're going to shrug, shoulders up, and as you exhale, you're going to bring them down. So inhale up, exhale down. Inhale up, exhale down. Two more.
last one. Fantastic. Again, just let your shoulders relax. Uh, toe tap straight down. Yep. I'm gonna add your bicep curls here. So one arm at a time. Keep your elbows tucked. And you can pretty much do this stuff seated if you choose. Excellent. Here's where that changes. So hip twist in. Hip twist out. Nice. And back to your toe tap straight down again. Nice. Bring your arms down, shake it out. Fantastic. This is a sloppy kind of march. Nice. Okay. So from here, kick it up a notch, just a little bit, change to a regular march, and making fists with your hands, make them soft fists, right? Nice. Do a little bit of marching here. Bring your arms up a little bit higher. Lift your heels a little higher. And do some um, push out front. All right. Stay with your march. So push one arm at a time. Push, push. Just straight out front's good. Spread your fingers. Your arms out back. And if you remark again, just let your arms sway this time. Toe tap to the back. And if you're holding on with one hand, that's okay. Do what you need to do. And then extend your arms. Nice. Spread your fingers. And bring those arms back down again into your march. Stay here for a second. And again, you work at your own pace. Drink when you're thirsty. Anything that causes you pain, just ignore. Don't do. All right. And yeah, and work at your own pace, of course. You can do some uh, breath strokes here. Out. Try and keep your arms extended. Do your best. Nice deep breath in. Two more. And one. And bring your arms down. Shake that out. Fantastic. Into your march again. Good. We'll do some windmills with your arms. So just watch what's around you. You can do one at a time. We'll just do one at a time. Start. So if you're holding on, just that outside arm. Excellent. Three, two, and one. Change direction. Same arm. Kind of unwind it here. Perfect. Three. Two, and one. And then arm down. Let those shoulders come back for you. Nice. We'll switch sides if you're just doing, if you need to hold on. All right. One, there we go. Nice. 
So your range of motion might be different than mine. That's okay. You can work with what you got. Excellent. Two and one. Nice. Bring that arm down. Swing it the opposite direction. Two and one. Nice. Bring those arms down. Again, just let them hang. Let your shoulders come back for you. Well done. We're going to go to heels in the front. Lift your toes. That's it. Perfect. Put your hands. We're going to go keep, make fists. Pull back. Keep your elbows tucked. Actually, your whole arms, keep them tucked into your body. Excellent. Make good fists this time. So you're crushing those eggs that were in your hands. Excellent. And change your heel to the front to a toe tap to the front. your arms the same, toe tap to the side, nice, perfect, and your toe tap back to the front again, nice, fantastic. Bring your arms down, shake them out, nice, and into your march, again that lazy march, let your arms hang. We're going to do some uh, hamstring curls, okay. hands are going to push back from your midline, so as you lift your heel, push back, again if you're holding on, that's all right. Heart lifted. Nice. Perfect. Four more. Three. Two. And we're going to switch to a knee up. Keep your hands the same. back into your march. So you should have some water with you. Good time for that. Have a sip. Keep those, uh, when you do drink the water while you're exercising, just keep them to sips. It's easier to digest and all that kind of thing. That big gulp wouldn't do you any good. All right. We're gonna do some punches. So you can go with your march, rolling march, or yeah, any of those two is good. Bring your fists up. And again, you're gonna make fists again. Start with your dominant hand and the other. Hook and up. Punch, punch, hook and up. Punch, punch, hook, up. Punch, punch, hook, up, punch, punch, excellent, punch, punch, hook, punch, punch, hook, up, punch, punch, hook, three more, hook, two, hook, and up, one, hook, and up. Keep your fists up. Nice. 
a breath. You need to. Wiggle your fingers. Excellent. Back to your march again. Fists are still up. We're going to punch with your non-dominant hand first and then follow through. All right. Punch, punch, hook, and up. Punch, punch, hook, and up. Punch, punch, hook, and up. As you punch, keep bends in your arms. You're not trying to straighten them all out. And up. Punch, punch, hook, and up. Punch, punch, hook, and up. All right, four more. Three, hook, and up. Two, hook, and up. And one, hook, and up. Fantastic. Wiggle your fingers here nice and easy. Excellent. Drop your arms down. Perfect. So either behind your chair or a little ways away. Hands, bring them behind. If you need to hold on, only one arm goes behind. Okay. Bring your feet apart. Nice. And add a little dip in between. And you don't need to go far. It can be just a small dip and just a easy side to side. Excellent. Perfect. And bring those arms out. Let them sway. Excellent. Arms down again. Push across your chest. Push, push. Excellent. Gentle rotation side to side here. So over. And again, you don't need to go far. It's all good. Breathe in through your nose. From your belly. Nice. Back to that push across your chest again. Nice. And we're going to go for that reach like you're picking apples. Reach. Opposite. Nice. So here's a crossover reach, right? Bring those arms down. This time, whatever way you lean, that's the way you're gonna reach. That's the side. Excellent. Perfect. Bring those arms back down again. And let your arms hang, nice and easy. Perfect, bring your feet back together. Little step tap here. Nice, arms back down, fantastic. Cross over your hands and your feet. back into your march again. Soft fists. Excellent. Well done. Let's do a little forward and backward action here. Forward and backward. I'm just going to turn to the side a little bit. So one foot's planted and the other one does the fancy footwork. Excellent. Perfect. You want to do a rocking horse? You need to hold on. Do that. 
Otherwise, you grab the reins on that front foot, lift it up just a little bit. You're breathing in, in and out through your nose. Excellent. And bring your feet back down. Nice. That front leg that's leading, you're going to bring it to the back. Other leg's going to go to the front. Nice. And we're going to do the exact same thing again. Okay. So whatever you did on the one leg, you're just going to match on this side. feet back down. Nice. Fantastic. And into your march again. Well done. We kind of slowed things down a little bit. So, in saying that, go into our cool down. One foot, heel toe. Excellent. And your opposite arm, you do a bicep curl. Keep your arm tucked and down. You can rock your hip if that helps. Down. Excellent. Excellent. Bring that arm down. We're going to change legs. Other side. Same thing. Heel to toe. That first, then add that opposite arm, the bicep curl, down. Excellent. Two more. One. Come into your rolling march. Nice. Fantastic. Hands. Do a little wrist roll here. Nice and easy. Lifting your heels, keeping your feet, the balls of your feet planted on the floor. Roll those wrists up front. Excellent. And change direction. Bring your fingers up, and down, opposite, nice. Just wiggle your fingers out front, nice, fantastic. And gently bring your arms down, shake that off, nice. Roll your shoulders one way. Change direction. Spine one feels good. Excellent. And one more. Fantastic. Again, just shake that out. Stay with your rolling march. Hands out to the side. Fingertips together. Your shoulders. Back out. Your shoulders back out. Nice. Shoulders back out. Two more. And out. Last one. And out. Excellent. Flip your palms. They're facing down the floor. Fingertips to ribs. And out. Ribs. Out. Two more. 
one more. Excellent. Make fist and flip. Fist, flick, fist. Excellent. And four more. Three more. Two more. And one. Bring your arms down. Nice. Let your shoulders relax. Stay with that rolling march. Take a couple of breaths. Nice. Keep your heart lifted. Right. Slow this roll down just a little bit. Some gentle lifts on your heels. Nice. Bring your ears over your shoulders. Gently set an ear down. Excellent. Breathe. back up to center and then the other side when you're ready over excellent back up to center well done uh, I think you've covered everything biceps yeah that's good Okay, so from here, let's go with, um, we'll do some weights, I guess. We'll have a sip of water. You can sit or stand for weights. Whatever works for you. Even if you're not using weights for this, um, just go through with the exercises anyways. Get used to the idea. All right, so feet will be flat on the floor. Soft knees. If you're seated, soft knees are a given. Excellent. Relax your shoulders for a minute. Okay. Take a breath. Excellent. Keep your heart lifted. Back flattish. All right. We'll do some shoulder shrugs. Your arms are going to stay straight. So inhale your shoulders up and exhale them down. Soft knees. And exhale down. I'm going to do 10 repetitions. You can do as many as what works for you today. Down to eight. Seven, follow your breath. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two, and one. Excellent, fantastic. Stop right there. Do some bicep curls. Uh, do hammer curls this time. So normally we have the, uh, our palm, your palms are facing me. This time, hold them so your palms are facing your legs, or your body rather. And you're gonna bring those up. Uh, we'll do one side at a time. Bring them up and down. Keep those elbows tucked and up. Nice and easy. Take your time. And up. Excellent. Check your posture. Make sure your knees are soft. Heart's lifted. Back is flat. down to seven. Breathe in and out through your nose. And six. Mm -hmm. 
five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Nice. Excellent. Fantastic. Stop right there. Again, let your shoulders relax. Let's go with um, a lateral raise. And again, it's going to be one arm at a time. Okay, so make sure that your posture is good first. Feet planted, soft knees, heart lifted. Nice. One arm at a time. Raise it up. No higher than your shoulder. And back down. And then the other side, same thing. Exhale as you bring those arms up. Eight. Seven. Posture, five, four, three, two. Set one of those weights down. A chair or table just away from you so it doesn't roll near you. So we go around the world here, handing off that weight from hand to hand. Again, keeping your torso straight. You may find that you're tightening your core so that you can uh, remain straight. A little bit of balance involved here. Soft knees. Heart lifted. Excellent. Try not to look as you're handing off that weight from side to side or whatever you're using. Nice. Two and one. Excellent. And chain sides around the other way. Again, the closer it is to your body, the easier it will be. The more you spread your arms out, again, the harder it will be. Excellent. Breathe. Three more. And two. And one. Perfect. Excellent. Um, pick up that weight and have a seat. Nice. All right. Just set your weights in your hip crease for a second. Just take a little break. Have a sip of water if you like. I mean, if your water's close. Excellent. Alrighty, let's go with uh, yeah, my two leg lifts. Oh, even better. Let's take those weights. We're going to set them aside. We're going to do some seated strength exercises and it will cover what I want to do. Okay. So, on your chair somewhere, lift your heart. Okay. We're going to do some leg lifts. We'll do one side again, we'll alternate side to side. Your leg up and out, back, 
and down. Other side, and out, back, and down. Up and out, back and down, up, out, back, down, other leg, back, down, up and out, back, down, up and out, back, down, halfway, Back, down, up, out, back and down, up and out, back and down, nice. chair walks here so no matter where you are in your chair just walk to the opposite walk to one side or to the back rather and then to the front lifting your hips excellent perfect get you to make your way to the front of your chair Stop right there. We'll do a seated crunch. Okay. Bring your arms, you can bring them up or you can cross your heart, cross your heart, whatever you choose is good. Exhale as you go forward, hinge from your hips, flat back, inhale back, touch your shoulders, and exhale forward. Your chair a little bit hover four three two one and all the way up perfect Let your shoulders come back nice let's do a toe drag here I'm just staying at the front one foot forward toe down lift your heel heart lifted drag that foot back be gentle if you're on carpet you want to make sure that that's nice and easy we're gonna do the same foot for all 10, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and one nice use that foot for a base and then the other legs can do the same thing 
toe tap, keep your heel lifted, bring it back. Watch how much weight you put on these legs. Okay? You don't need to put a lot on, or you can lean more and put more weight on your legs, whatever's good for you. Excellent. Halfway. Three. Two. And one. Fantastic. Bring your foot back. So we're going to go on to balance, but first have a sip of water. Then you like it's nice and close. I'll get you to stand in behind your chair. That's how we're going to start. Okay. Excellent. Hands on your chair. I'm going to move mine aside so you can see what's going on. All right. So feet kind of close together. Closer is more of a challenge, so work at your own pace, of course. Okay, you can start by holding on. You're going to come up on the balls of your feet. Let your shoulders relax. Excellent. And if you're holding on, just little one second releases. Get your, eye, get your body used to the idea of balance. And if you're already balancing, fantastic. So put your hands on your chair. You're gonna to lean to one side, just over just a couple of degrees, and slowly lower back down. Bring yourself back to center. Nice. Back up again, balls of your feet. Over to the other side this time. Lean, and then slowly lower back down. Nice. Back to center. Perfect. One more. Up. Over. Slowly back down, nice, back to center, up again, up, over the other side, down, slow, and back to center, fantastic, well done. Let's go for, stay behind your chair, because you got it for balance if you like. One of your legs, you're just going to bring it, open your leg, right? Heel to somewhere on that leg, above your ankle, on your shoe, anywhere is good. The idea is you want to put as much weight as you can on that sturdy leg and the bent leg as little as you can get away with. Okay? And again, you still got your balance. Okay? Again, just little tests. Okay? Lift your heart. I'm just going to stay here for uh, 15 seconds, so three breaths. It's nice and easy. Breathe. Nice. Fantastic. Bring that leg in. Set down. Bring your feet back together. And we're going to do the other side. Okay. So again, you're still behind your chair. Open that leg up this time. Okay. If you get a kink or a, like a Charlie horse in your hip, bring your knee forward more. And you find that spot where you can you know, get rid of that Charlie horse. Again, lots of weight on the one leg, as little as possible on the light leg. Nice. Perfect. Lift your heart. Relax your shoulders and your jaw. Breathe. Two more breaths. One more breath. Fantastic. Bring that leg in. Nice. Set that leg down. Just kind of shift your hips a little bit. Nice. Uh, now you get your step beside your chair. Okay. Your inside leg is going to be your weight bearing leg. So this is a little more of a workout, so you work at your own pace, of course. The outside leg is going to do the alphabet. So start. You can do it all scripty, as pretty as you like as simple as you like. Do some small letters and 
some big letters. And again, test your balance somewhere along the line, maybe a couple of times. If you forget letters, it doesn't matter. I'm not going to say a word. If you beat me to the end of the alphabet, fantastic. And if I beat you, then you can stop. All right. I'm going to switch sides. So you got that chair to lean on should you need it. Right. Again, the inside leg's going to be weight bearing this time. Outside leg, the alphabet. And just start whenever you're ready. Just breathe all the way through. It's not a test some fun with it. Excellent. Breathe. Excellent. Perfect. And the last bit. Excellent. Just kind of shake that out. Fantastic. All right. Uh, let's go uh, behind your chair again. Get you to hold on. Okay. So coming up on the balls of your feet, forward. Nice. You can test your balance here if you like. Excellent. Put your hands back down on your chair. Lift your toes as you lean back. You're going to hold this. Four, three, two, one. And roll back onto your balls of your feet. Excellent. Hold it. Hold it. Four, three, two, one. Slowly back down. Lift your toes. Excellent. Hold it for four, three, two, one. Bring your feet back. Fantastic. So I just want to do some stretches. I'm going to get you to sit first, and then we'll stand for some of the uh, stretches also. Okay. So the old standbys, you know, should know them off by heart. So one leg up at the front of your chair, and one leg straight, and your toe up toward your knee. Hands on that bent leg. And again, lift your heart and tilt forward from your hip, keeping your back flat. Be gentle on the tilt. You're not trying to hurt anything. Just give it a little stretch. All right? And then three breaths. Relax your shoulders. Excellent. And gently you're gonna release that leg. Grab a hold of it either underneath or in the front, or if you're not going to grab a hold of it, keep your heart lifted. Do your three breaths. Excellent. From here, you got a couple of choices again. Either cross it up top or at your ankles. Your call. Whatever you feel good doing today. And again, you want to lift your heart, kind of a flattish back. Excellent. One more breath. Excellent. Fantastic. And set that foot down. And do the other side, same thing. Just straighten your leg. Go up towards your knee, heart lifted. Nice easy breath. Fantastic. Nice. 
length, bring that leg up. And again, you're gonna match what you did on the other side. So if you brought it up like so, you're gonna do it again on this side. And if you didn't, you're just gonna do the same thing, all right? One more breath. Excellent. And that leg, bring it down. Perfect. Just kind of stamp them out a little bit. Wake them up. Excellent. All right. From here, I'm going to get you to stand up. I'm just behind your chair. Give yourself a good wide stance. Big. Excellent. Fantastic. Um, actually, your feet don't want them parallel. Bring them out a little bit so that they track with your knees. So if you were to bend your knees, your legs, how they go, you want the feet in that same angle, okay? And again, you've got your chair. You're behind your chair, okay? <laughs> your arms out to the side. You're just gonna reach for the walls. Nice, take a breath. Excellent. Roll your thumbs down. Hold that. Excellent. Roll your thumbs back up. Perfect. One of your arms is going to go up. Grab your collar. The other arm is going to come around your back like a belt. If your elbows and shoulders allow all that to happen. Otherwise, you might use that low hand for holding onto your chair. Breathe. And we're going to unwind those arms, bring them back out to the side. Perfect. And we're going to switch. The other arm's going to go high this time. Grab your collar. Get nice, easy breaths here. Unwind your arms again. Perfect. Bring them out to the sides. Perfect. And just lower them down nice and easy. Fantastic. Let your shoulders come back. Take your hands and put them on your hips. Okay. I'm just going to do a little hip shift here. So pick a side. We're going to do both. So shift your hips first. The option is to lean into that. So it opens up your ribs. Breathe. Excellent. On an inhale, bring yourself back up to center. Straighten out your hips, your back. All right. Let everything come back to home. And when you're ready, you're going to shift your hips to the other direction this time. And then lean into it if you did on the other side. And match it all up. If you're doing the uh, upper body side stretch, you want to kind of bring your body up and out. You're not trying to crunch up all the inside here. Again, on an inhale, bring yourself back up. Fantastic. Again, just let your body come back. Drop your hands. Uh, we're going to interlock your fingers, but in behind your back. Okay. And push down. You feel a stretch across your chest, down your arms. Watch your back. Don't arch it, try and keep it as flat as you can. 
tilt your pelvis to make that happen. Extend. Stay with your belly breath. Send in and out through your nose. Excellent. One more breath. Gently release your hands, your shoulders back to center. Wiggle your fingers here. Nice, excellent. Shake that out. That's fantastic. You did excellent today. Cross your arms, little squat. Inhale up. Exhale down. Nice, one more. Perfect, fantastic. Well done, have a great weekend.